David, you've left your characters behind, but a lot of your fans are still locked in them. Do you feel any sense of responsibility to them? To the characters? To the fans. To the characters more than the fans. Um, I think the fans have their own roads to go in life. I think they're quite capable of dealing with it. Um, my concern is the characters that I write and the stories that I write about. Do you think the fans are capable of dealing with it? But are you putting... Um... There are other fellow human beings. They're quite as capable as I am. I'm sure they know. <laughs> are you attributing to them the same degree of intelligence that you've got? Intelligence as... Um... That's, that's, that, that's not necessary in, in what I do. It's what I do. It has nothing to do with intelligence. It has to do with just a, um, an interest in, in observing different kinds of societies. Um, I think you just have to be a sort of a social animal to be a writer. And where's the path going to go? Still in music or more into films that you've been doing recently? Um, I've tended to stereotype myself as a, a generalist. Um, so that I may have the freedom of movement in, from one field to another quite easily. Um, so I would, I would extend myself to films. Um, I would extend myself more into painting, which is something I had dropped up until a couple of years ago. But I picked up the shreds and started, found my acrylics and started painting again. Um, I don't really know what else I want to do other than that. I'm quite happy. Travelling, I think. I like travelling an awful lot.